And welcome back. This is Kotel for another War Rights video. And we have a UEC on this fine Saturday. Hope everybody's enjoying the weekend so far. And it is a valley map on contention. Uh, 338 on the server pop right now. 166 on the CSA team versus 172 on the USA team. Let's take a look at those two teams here briefly. And uh, I should have a guest joining us momentarily. Oh, I'm here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, there he is. All right. So we have Mr. Killer from the ANV, the uh, Alabama the Northern uh, something over there. I'm not even sure now. The Army of Northern Alabama, just for short, you know. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Right. And uh, you're joining us from uh, cell phone connection, so, um, you know, <laughs> it is uh, a bit spotty, but we're going to try to make this work. We're going to do it live. Awesome. <laughs> budget <laughs> oh you guys get to get what you pay for with this stream man really you know the all the sh raid shadow legends the uh at some point the check's gonna come in yeah we, we lost we lost the sponsorships so and i went down the mobile phone connection <laughs> all right but um yep uh so let's take a look at these two teams i'll start out with the union team looks like we got german corps on the guns on colonel v bar Ooh, along with jeff little... davis battery under yeah, lieutenant he's fork he's and so corporal yeah. habib <laughs> And swinging over to the infantry. And my stream cuts out. Let me know, uh, Mr. Killer. We have your guys, the A and V, both the 10th Alabama collection, 1st Alabama, and then the 6th Alabama. And then we have 3rd Alabama. A lot of Alabama today. Let's see. Then we've got Alabama German Legion. 6 Texas to break up the Alabama. Then we've got 1st Virginia. And then we have the NYV, the 88th, and the 6th. Leading it, let's see who we've got. We've got um, GameBot leading 6. Viferic leading the other elements. Wesley leading the NYV, 88th. Williamson is leading 3rd Alabama. Memento Mori is leading AGL. NYV is led by Parker. And Rousseau is leading the 6th Texas. All right, so it looks like we've got Liferic and Gamebot here leading the ANV. Um, so what can you tell me about these two chaps? Well, you already know what Gamebot's like. He's a bloody madman. Yeah, you know, I thought, I, I, I thought you were like the you know, new flank maneuvers, and he, he takes a cake, though, man. He, he, loves, he loves cake. Life Eric is, um, he'll tell you to, like, get your reloads, and then two seconds later, like, oh, break your reloads, come on, I'm really, like, forgetting that everyone still has to reload, especially when he's got a pistol, and he forgets that it takes 20 seconds with a rifle. Ah, it's a man of action. He, he, well, he's, you know, he's a captain of a cavalry regiment, so, you know, take that as you will. Oh, yeah. And we are live, but we got a little bit of time as these guys move out here, so we'll look at the other team. Looks so, like we got SB here under Private Jake with one gun for the CSA, Perkington from MBAT with another gun, and then LFL under this Sugar with another cannon. I'll swing up to the infantry side, kind of see them as they come down here. Let's see, we've got 20th Georgia under Jumbo, joined by 8th Florida. Then we've got SB under Venom. And we've got 4th New Jersey in here as well. Looks like under... I'm not sure who's leading them. Let's see. It might be Pixel. I don't see him in here, though. Uh, then we've got, let's see, John Beck leading the 52nd. Slaughter leading the 56th. Let's see. Well, oh, I miss these guys over here. You missed all of them just going on the other side. Yeah, they went the other way. <laughs> all right, we've got LFL under Polignac. We've got, I'm sure I fucked up his name right there. Fort Georgia under Owens. Eddie leading the home guard. Uh, let's see here. we got Knight leading the TB. And did I catch these guys? I think I did. Yeah, it's 20th. All right, if I missed you, I do apologize. But, um, yep, again, you get what you pay for. Um, once I get a new sponsorship, you might get a better camera crew. All right, so I don't, I don't think I've seen uh, too many contentions on this map. Uh, what do you?
you what are you expecting to see on this one, Mr. Killer? Well, I mean, it's pretty much literally just schoolhouse bridge, but extended on both sides. So it's just, the strategy is pretty much every intention map. It's just go for the flag. There's always a couple of flags. Oh, nice shot. Like There's always a couple of flags that you know the sides don't want to go for. Come on, get get on the on that and I. So like, yeah. stop rising. There's only a couple of times both sides choose not to go for, but on this map, it's pretty much like on a straight line all the way down the road, so every point's pretty much in play. Yeah. Um. I mean, I'm I'm not quite sure how this one's gonna go. Yeah. This is kind of a weird. I've seen this on Conquest a few times, but I don't think I've seen contention on this one. I think we're gonna get a lot of a lot of bloodbath here, but. Okay. This is probably one of the better maps. No! To be Normally, like with conquest, it's like one close to each spawn, and then one in the middle. Whereas on conquest, they're just like three dotted on one on the far right, one on the far left, and one in the middle. So you can pretty much fight for any point. Yeah, no, I, it, and yeah, it, it spreads out the fighting here. It's but even then, I'm looking at it. This is a very spread out fight. I mean, look how far down this line is. What do you think of the uh, CSA spreading the field this much? Well, I don't know who that who that is in front of you. Is that 50 seconds? Yeah, 50 seconds. I mean, they probably want to ship more left, maybe even by that tree where the other CSA group is, just so they're a bit more consolidated, because the Union seems to be a bit more, at least closer together for the most part. Do you think maybe they're trying to see if they can uh, make a play for the next point? To be fair, with this obviously starting five minutes late, like starting at 40, missed five minutes on the five, there is a possibility that they can, you know, pre-plan for the next one, because obviously it's, it's, I think that's the furthest left or right point, depending on how you're looking at it. So the next point is definitely going to be closer to the middle of the map, no matter like where you are, so being more left or right, depending on what side you are, isn't a bad shout, but I guess since they only just captured it, you probably want to fight around the point first. Yeah, I mean, they did They did take the point, so it's, it's uh, you know, you don't want to just give it up. I would say maybe I would have done that if, if, you, if the other team had taken the point, um, but I don't know. It's a lot of fire coming in right now on these poor guys on this point. Yeah, to be fair, it's a pretty packed server, so even having having 20, 30 guys. Yeah, not I, I mean it's it's not pretty packed. It's packed. We're at 350. <laughs> Jeez, yeah, it, it is it is packed. It's as full as it's gonna get. Yeah, this is gonna be. Um, yeah, I don't know who overbrought. Keep out the fire. Quickest push is gonna be. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of surprised the Union hasn't made a bigger push right now, but um, I don't think they have the uh, the rules on this, no sprinting or anything, do they? I, I don't think they do. No, no, Oh, these guys, two USC got nailed. Oof. They've kind of dealt with the guys in the field for the most part, so they just need to deal with the people down the road, which... It's a lot easier to deal with than getting shot from two angles, so... Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. You can see those uh, Artie crews are putting in some work, though. So what kind of role do you think Artie will play on this map? Well, I mean, if you look at the map, it's just complete open field, so... It's probably, like, one of the, the, one of the better maps for artillery in the game, to be honest, this map. That and, you know, the, the odd couple of others, but... See, see, they're quite spread out, aren't they? Yeah, I, I can't get over how spread out. I mean, that's already in that far side there, but the rest of this, again, I, I, maybe they're looking to. Uh, that's the only explanation I can come up with is they're looking to cap the next yeah. one. If I was the Union, I would have sent one of your smaller groups, even maybe the Skirms, towards the CSA artillery position. Up and over, up and over, up and over, that's up and in a pretty up and over. open position where you can take it. Front and front I feel like if they the can silence the CSA artillery, that'll definitely help. Charge them on the right, charge them on the right, boys. Straight oh, into the right. One yeah, I think that might have worked well. Well, we do have a pretty big push here by the Union now. 
Led by third Alabama and Memento Mori. So I guess he's trying to keep him off, but I don't know if they can for as long as they need to. Uh, NYV came up, but the rest of the Union is still holding back. But to be fair, I think they're... That's enough for now, from what I can tell. You got the small element oh, wow. out here, but they got LFL. I didn't even watch this fight, but they got they got beat back here it. by uh, uh, looks like uh, your guys. Kill the flags first. Yeah, shoot that damn flag. Man, I miss your guys doing all their work on this flank here. And then we got AGL, Alabama German Legion. All the Bamas on the right. Uh, we got, we got, we got all the Bamas on here. We got, we got. This is the Bama flank here. Hold the pile. Got AGL. We got your guys. We got uh, Third Alabama. We're roll tied here. NFL probably shouldn't have stopped there. They should have probably fell back. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Not even yeah. Detrimental on contention. So now the Union has taken this point. What do you think the CSA should be doing now here if you were them? Would you try to contest it or just kind of let it go and uh, wait for the next opportunity? Well, I can't. How long is left to the Yellow Tower? Is it like a minute? Uh, one minute, 30 seconds. Yeah, so realistically, if the CSA don't want to fight over it for uh, like seven minutes, which is obviously the whole time that the Union needs to hold it for, they could always just try and wait until the Yellow Timers run out and then lower the flag because then realistically nobody goes down a whole stage because the flag will just immediately change yeah i think that's so, a good, i think that's a good strategy yeah just and then you're it's even and you and you're better i mean look now the union's all st stuck on this one side of the field here yeah so the csa should have an open open door on the next the next flag since they've pretty much they've got the rest of the map and the union's kind of pushed back into one i'm well, not necessarily pushed back but now has to hold in one little corner of the map. And if I was the Union, I'd try and start to spread their forces a little bit more. If it looks like somebody's doing by the road. Uh, those are your guys, yep. No, it's going well. We're going to hold this line. Not as many side, uh, you know, back uh, angles as I would uh, like to see. We'll see if some more come up later. It's too open, man. You can't get around people that I'm not with. I mean, some people can find a way. Uh, it's much tougher, yeah. How can you? How can you hit the jumbo in the back? You know what I mean? Do it. No, it's much. I mean, if they when they respawn, maybe if they get wiped, but uh, it'd be hard to do it in the middle of this open field. Absolutely, kind of a slugfest. Yeah, if I was them, I'd get over the road. Yeah, that, that D jump on the two snake fences. Fire straight down. Kind of, kind of weird. TB's trying to go up there. Yeah. Yeah. Because the angle of the shots at the minute is probably not the greatest. Keep shooting. We got friendlies in the legs. Six reform back here. Six reform back here. Quickly. Six reform here. Yeah, it looks like the Union's got a lot of coverage up here as well, so I don't, I don't know if they can be able to succeed at a raid. Well, if these CSU guys manage to push in D back, they'll be able to put flanking shots into the guys in that field, but obviously they've got third hour. Yeah. yeah, that's that's a that, that's a that's a big uh, big lift. Knock it out, A and P and Third Alabama. With two flags, yeah. They also, you know, you got two flags supporting them. Each one's got a flag, so.
Oof. And that Ooh. GC Yardy coming in too. Oh, your boys are charging. Uh, what do you think about that charge from your boys? Uh, I think it was definitely card coming in. They, they got to disrupt. Because if you disrupt them, especially with a game mode like this, where it's time-based, like it gives you, I think it's seven minutes on the dot from when you capture the flag to when you capture it. Like when it actually captures it. So, time, it's a bit like being in a fire. You don't have a whole lot of time to think. So if you can wipe out a force that removes them off the field for a good couple of minutes while they refall and stuff. Oh yeah. It looks like we have another attack on this angle though. SB versus NYV. I don't know if they got enough here. Looks like NYV's gonna beat them pretty easy. Eddie's gonna oh. come and try to help. Let's go to the sixth. Oh, look at that, a flank attack. Here we go. Eddie got one in. All right. All right, boom. Oh, we're behind us. He's got doublets. Fuck. Come here, I want your doublets. That doublet killed you. Hey, yo, bro. Oi, Mr. Rebel. Mr. Rebel, what are you doing? No, no, no. Okay, we're okay. Recall to me. Recall to me. All right, looks like that ended that. Except for this poor man. <laughs> Oh. Oh, you can't retreat and surrender. That's against the uh, laws of war. Yeah, that, that's probably the CS had done for that flag, to be honest. Yep, but yep. Because it's been so for it, they're going to be almost at taken losses after they capture it. No, that's going to be a tough one. But again, though, Union's still in one position here. The CSA does have time. We'll see where the next point is. Um, How many flags did the CSA lose? Just the one? I am only seeing one down, so that's not bad. It's not horrible. Oh God, he's fucking crazy. Get in the snake fence, Squawk. We're gonna kill them all if that flag Guac. Hot fucking barrels. You heard him. He said independent fire. On Guac, independent fire. Join him with. Join him with him. Give him the fucking ball. Give him the fucking ball, boys. Tennessee Lake, come on. Oh, here comes first VA charging it. No, no, no. Yeah, I just heard a curse word. I hope the admin is not watching. Terrible. Yeah, well, I, I you know. <laughs> I think it's uh, who's who's admin in today? Let's see. Looks like we got Oswald. It looks like uh, Malarkey. Well, I think they I think they use four admins when we do one server. I'm sure, they use four. Oh, okay. Then that means Desaye and Summer too, probably Sumeri. Yeah, I think normally they do two per server, but when we combine, they still just do four, because to be fair, it's 350 people, so... A lot of people to cover. But yeah, so we got our we got our next point all the way on that other side of the field here. Um, so now if you were the CSA, stick it with them, how would you approach this defense here? Uh, it's a tricky one, because you could always hold where you are and keep the pretty much keep the Union back on the far side of the map while you send the unit and a flag to capture. But then again, there's, the, the map is that big that the Union could just fall back towards spawn and then swing around from spawn. Yeah, and just, by, and just bypass whatever defense you set up. Yeah, it's, honestly, it's always probably ideal in contention to stay within like 150 yards of the flag if you're defending it. Don't go anywhere too far where you can't reinforce. But obviously, it stays spread out enough to where you can cover all the angles. There's an enemy on the right. We ignore that. Yeah, but then Union, what do you what do you think in your your plan is right now? Just rush or if there's units of CSA still holding like there is, rush them, wipe them off the field. If you can get a flag, get a flag, which I think is what 
Oh, look game at this! Soon, right? We got yeah, GameBot doing a back shot here. Or at least a side the shot. Not the ones in the back. The ones in the front, just wait a second, you can get them in the back. Oh no, we got a couple. <laughs> That's their scene, they ran people. into that. <laughs> they thought they were friendly, yeah. Oh, poor yeah. Owens. Quickly, get your loads. Get oh, your he's loads. Irish. Make sure you're ready. Yeah, It'd be funny right. now if TV ended up shooting into them. It's just a big old, oh, big old red arrow. Yeah. Oh, we got a uh, we got a counter charge by two USC into the NYB. Run, run, run. Oh, they might they might get them here actually. And that'd be a big thing if they can knock down. Oh, the flag got away, but. Is Eddie running away? Yeah, Eddie. Eddie is running away. Take him down. Take him down. But he's he's leading him wow. to. He's 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 running he's away. He's the entire fucking NYV. He's running them into the into the outside. Right. 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 He, he, he said, "Artie, you take care of it." Prepare to defend yourself. Oh shit. Yeah, I, I, I like condition a lot, but it's very hard to cover on a 350. There's, there's no sort of organization right now. Everyone's just kind of everywhere. Just yeah, like here, here's six Texas doing a charge into the Artie. Then, like, behind six Texas, he's going through the room. There's another CSA unit. I don't know that's all he's behind him. Stolen by. Stolen by. And I think those are your guys over on that far side there, if I had to bet. Oh shit, he might. Honestly, I, I wouldn't yeah, put it past them. Like, Eric loves the forest if he can get in one. Yeah. Let's go check I it. think so does Game Boy. Yeah, so let's see here. There's third Alabama. Yep. 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 Yeah. Yeah, that's probably the most ideal position to attack from, because you do have a slight bit of defilade cover too. Going in from that forest. Attacking straight down the road is optional, but you're pretty much open the entire way to getting shot from multiple angles. At least from the forest, you're getting shot from one angle. Yep. Here comes Slaughter trying to uh, stop him, or at least delay him a little bit. He's going to get caught out by the Dandy and the. Yep, you're right. <laughs> Come, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's charging. Of course they're charging. Get that flag. Get their flag. Up they go. To be fair, they've kind of managed to circle around them a little bit, but they're going to run into... As long as they don't jump over and they're a bit more distant. Nope, they're going over. They're going over. They're going over. <laughs> As long as they don't do the oh, they're doing it. Yeah. Yeah, you got Knight kind of as a reinforcement. That should be enough, I think, to hold them. At least for now. Do you think your guys overextended a little bit, or? Yeah, yeah. If they held in the fence, they might have been able to do a little bit more, last a bit longer. But if they managed to wipe SP, which is going to be a big loss. Especially with third Alabama being on the case too. I don't think the case will hold very long. No, but uh, we do got reinforcements coming in. Looks like SB's on the way. Oh, they came back quick. Yeah, and you still got these guys out here. I think this yeah, is. I still still I, who, whoa, there's an already shot. Fort George is attacking. Especially you know, you know, you're actually right some sort of. Like, Just right off the big something to, to, to end there, with sure. NYV. Like, they've got some deal that needs to be, uh, needs to be sorted out. There's some, there's, just, there's some beef in there. Yeah. Alright, let's swing back over here so we can see this area. Looks like it's, uh... So, yeah, now it looks like they're pulling off a little bit. So, if you were advising your team right... Well, the USA team right now, how would you approach this attack at this point? Kind of zoom out to uh, make it a little bit easier to see. Some forces on the snake fence down the road, just to shoot at the field side. 
and the rest should be looking to attack from the forest. Kind of hooking up on the other side. Them. What's that? Yeah, you could use that creek. And you, there's also like a bit of a hill kind of just to your right where that little tree is. A little defilade. We're behind you now. But... Do you know like the schoolhouse ridge one that's used quite a bit? Yeah, right there. Where the little set of rocks is, but... Yeah, there's a little defilade there that you, that you can use to do some like cresting and stuff, but you don't really have the time to do that much stuff and intentionally you've got to kind of go with it. But that's kind of the beauty of it, is if CSA capture this flag now, I think it'll be pretty much level. Yeah, it'll be it'll be an even fight again. Oh, but your boys are coming up again. Again, it's just, this is the Alabama, combined Alabama army here this whole game. The third in A and B. AGL in there as well. It's oh Eddie's somehow back here. I don't know how the hell did he get over here. Brace, lads, brace. Second brace. Fuck you, boy. Back on the base. Back on the base. Back on the base. Is Hank with first VA? Uh, but looks like Knight held on along with uh, 56 over here. And 52nd, that's a pretty big line. I think maybe if the CSA was to group up and push that right flank of the point, overwhelm it, and then swing down, wipe them sort of group by group in detail. Yeah, I think you're right, and to be honest with you, if you can knock out some of their flags before you go on to this next point, um... That might give the uh, CSA the advantage they need. It's risky. Yeah, well, considering this point is the one on the other side, the opposite end of the field, it's kind of the same situation for the Union now as it was for the CSA, whereby they have the whole map to play with. Yeah, it's kind of a mirror of what we had on that last one, isn't it? Yeah. I say this is an easier position to defend than the last one. Oh, absolutely. There's less room for flanking. So, do you think uh, Union should pull off now and kind of just wait for the next point, or? With the amount, of, they've probably got like a minute thirty, two minutes left on the timer. Before they capture the the point, so maybe just start setting up to, you know, defend it. And if I was the CSA, this would be the time where you start kind of advancing out a little bit. They're missing. Don't worry about it. Waist tight. Waist tight. By company. A. Yeah, I think you're right on that. I think you can sometimes get a little bit uh, if you're not paying attention to the time. You uh. Get a little bit too complacent. Oh, no. we've got a raid here. Who is this? Knight. Is is going just straight down the road here. I guess trying to flank uh, flank the NYV. At that blob, at that blob. Ten C. Fire! Hell yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, looks like Union's pulling back. Smart choice. Yep, I think I agree. Because they'll still have a... Uh, still in the corner of the forest, so. Yeah. Um, fighting in front of the forest? The, the Union unit in the corner. Who's that small one? That is Alabama German Legion. I mean, I don't think that's a horrible idea. Just kind of delay for a little bit, you know, maybe uh, get them chase you into the woods into nothing as opposed to going for the point. I can't remember who the skirms are on both sides. Uh, the they might be skirms. In fact, I think, I think they are. Yeah, that, that's probably why they're doing that then. But yeah, so you're pulling back, I think, worked out well. Now the uh, uni could set up right there. And the CSA is going to have to okay. launch an attack. I don't know why they're all pulling off the road though, because that's if the CSA takes the road, it's going to be a blind shootout into the forest. Over the fence. 
Yeah, I mean, it looks like 3rd Alabama moved up, but they got hit pretty hard here by 20th. We need help, second. We need help. Yeah, we got an even fight right now. Well, I don't think 3rd Alabama can stand up much longer to this. Uh, all that charging. Oh, Lord. I don't know about that. Yeah, the loss of that flag is, uh, that's going to be pretty big, I think. Oh, they're getting the, the flags getting surrounded. Yeah, he got wiped out. That might make a big difference here. We'll see. They're a pretty chunky force. Someone's pushing the room, which is not smart, or at least the creek. Yeah, up and over, up and over. And that is, uh, yeah, your guys. Watch that. Shooting. By the way, everybody, he's watching my stream, so you know it's not. He's not like, oh, these guys are smart doing this, knowing who it is. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm not really sorry, just digging up my own unit for the sake of it. Don't forget to give space, gents. Don't forget to give space. Aim for the flag. I'm just waiting for them to do something bad so I can Kill just flag, openly man. criticize them on stream. Oh, That's what I'm waiting for. <laughs> oh, it's just a massive team kill, or you know. It's an absolute team. suicidal charge. The Irish Brigade at Fredericksburg, Irish. Yeah. Well, now, what do you think about this setup for the Union for defending? Horrible. Think they should have stayed Stay on the road, try to contest it a little bit more? Yeah, yeah, I mean, they pretty much opened up an entire, like, flank now for the CSA to kind of pull and give them a bit of a bridgehead. Because there's not much distance between the road and that, and the point. No, they got, I mean, now, yeah, they got the elevated, you know, entrenched position up here, basically like a trench line with the the river and then the, you know, fence, and then you've got the flank over here, so you got a nice L shape that's kind of formed. Uh, their own blob looking for us. Someone should work to try, oh, someone's already doing it, to try and flank that road group. Ah, it looks like it is 6 Texas. Joined by some other folks. I think mostly six Texas, from what I can tell. Maybe some two core as well. Just to at least be a thorn in the side and stop the CSA from focusing on the point. Although, speaking of, looks like we got a charge in. Give me that flag. Let's go, damn. Stop the flag from being retaken, damn. Let's go. All right, we got him. We got him. Return to the rocks. Return to the rocks. Uh, it was only oh, left that flag. There was only one unit, though. Oh, someone's flanking hard left. How about that second U.S.? It's like Slaughter over here is moving up. You see, yeah, that's 3rd Alabama coming back. And you can see 6 Texas did draw off a whole big unit over there. Yeah. That's good. Like I say, it's time in this game. And if you can pull a unit away for 2 minutes, that's 2 minutes less there. Not focused on trying to take the point. Where's the Irishman going? Get in, get in. Come on, guys. Clean this shit up. Cobb, Cobb, back up. Everybody get in. I can't, I can't. I got pushed out. Charge bandits! Gotcha. All right, let's go. At the sprint forward. At the sprint forward. March. All right, it looks like here's the next big charge ah, coming in. Go, chips. Oh, looks like Victor's in charge of Fort New Jersey. Get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Come on, buddy. I'm in charge. I'm in charge. I'm in charge. Ah, give me your blood! Come out, boys! Come out! Ah, uh, once more, only y one unit charging in, though. Yeah, that wasn't gonna. That wasn't really gonna make ground. Now the CSA has taken this flank over here, so I'd say this is like some good news, some bad news stories, but. Yeah, most of the unions kind of 
went to the that northern side of the forest to get the majority of the CSCs on the southern side of the forest. Oh, but here comes Gamebot trying to stop the uh, two USCSB force here, along with six Texas. This might be pretty key here, I think. My hold on long enough. If reinforcements, no. Yeah, someone's coming in to reinforce. Yep, it's Mr. Parker. Yep, I think that was just enough time. Uh, gotta love those team kills. <laughs> oh, wow, yeah. This is good from Parker. Yeah. 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 Get out! I'm oh, sorry, Dart. Get, kill the flag bear! Kill the flag bear! Ah! Wow! Um, the point is open. After all that, there was another charge over here that I missed by uh, 56, and they have succeeded. Where's all the Union going? They get there. There was a charge I missed on the other side while we were watching that other action, and it looks oh. like 56 uh, and Fort Georgia. Use, use we're successful after a uh, oof. Oh shit! Come send us some money. Take the money up, Lotte. So yeah, it, they opened it up enough with that flank attack to uh, charge on the other side. Enemy flag picked up. Shoot him to the left. No, all the unions on the other side, man. They just. No, that's just a, that's just a uh, EGL. Oh, that's just EGL. Not even all the union. I don't even know where the hell the unions disappeared to. Yeah, I mean you got they some. Could have all got one. You got well, I mean you got some of Third Alabama here, but not much of it. That's crazy. Yeah, I, w I wasn't looking. Yeah, there was a charge. CSA won it. Now that you've taken it, though, what do you think the CSA should set up their defense at this point? been taken because obviously it extends the time now so they've got another seven minutes to how long is that to the yellow timer I'm uh, blind, yeah, so. yellow time timer is six minutes 30 seconds so so they've got six minutes and 30 which is just a little bit less than the time it takes for them to capture it which if the csa can or if the usa can get the the csa closer to breaking and then manage to retake the point with the the timer now being reset back to seven minutes, it gives them more time to get the tickets close to breaking. And if they can manage to recap it, then they might get it a last stand. But if not, then obviously the CSA could possibly get the union close to breaking, and then once they cap it, close to last stand. Yeah, well, I mean, the other thing, too, is the uh, the overall timer is only 4 minutes and 50 seconds left, so, you know, this is, this is it. <laughs> yeah, this, they, they can't not fight for this point now, though, because if the CSA captures that the Union isn't going to be able to do a full fight for the next point, because they're going to be half stage away from breaking. Well, it's just, the, the timer's it's almost over, point. too. The, the main timer's 4 minutes, 30 seconds. Oh, yeah, crap, yeah. It's, it's probably going to end in a draw. Yeah, I mean, if the CSA can hold the point, they win. If the Union knocks it down, I think it's a draw. If if I, if I have it right at this point. Well, no, I think the no matter what's left on the cap, even if the, the match hey, ends, the south, ends, south, 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 south. Um. If the last time it ends, it's yes, like the yes, time you're ends. you're right. Yep. So if it ends and the draw breaking. Then I feel like that's more common in the UEC for contention and conquest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Draws, yeah. For contention, seems to be a little bit more draw heavy. Oh, 
là, ah, je vais Oh, Alta la charge. I'm gonna hold off on uploading just to make sure the connection's stable. I think it's been working pretty well so far. Have you been, have you been uh, just... apologies to all the viewers that are excited to watch this as soon as the event comes. Yeah, you're gonna have to wait like a half hour now, so you know, it's just these great uh, impositions on you. Although they're gonna have... Yeah, they're gonna have to reset the map, so actually I might be able to just stop streaming while they reset the map. And it might upload that fast. Ah, uh, 10 minutes. It takes longer to process, but the upload itself is about 10 minutes. So, like, processing the HD and all that shit takes longer. Yeah, but the actual upload doesn't usually take me that long. To be fair right now, if the CSA just said screw it and went super aggressive, they could wipe out that little group, get the union to breaking, and then just try and pull off for a minute and thirty seconds, and they might win. They they might. It's 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 that 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 yeah. timing is you know tough to do, but you, there's no reason not to. It's tough to do, but I that's what I'd be trying to do right now because I'm a I'm cheesy like that. Yeah, I I I, 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 I do the same. If you know you're gonna get counterattacked, but you know. You might hit that timing just right. The only problem when I'm commentating like this is because I just, like, I wish I was there and I could do something different. Just watching, I'm like, why are you doing that? Just do this instead. I mean, that's a commentating thing, though. You know, it's, you know, if you're on the ground, you're like, no, I did this because I want to. It doesn't mean, you know, just different, different perspectives, different, you know. And you can see things differently, you know, with this view. You know, it's like, okay, you know, I've got the magic, you know, I see everything button. Yeah. <laughs> It's like if I'm watching or if like I'm leading and someone says something, like makes a comment, and I'm like, well, you don't know what the hell's going on, man. You stupid pundit. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's always easy this way. It's like, oh, I can see everybody, at, you know, and, you know, big sky view. It's like, you know, dude, I'm in the middle of a, you know, a forest here with, you know. <laughs> That's so easy. <laughs> Oh, the Union might throw this away if they go to break it. Uh, yeah, I think they were being uh, a little bit over aggressive here. There they go. 15 seconds remaining. Oh no. Oh no. They've got five seconds to get the break it. Nope. They did it. I think it does go all the way. I think it does go all the way to the uh, the end of the yellow. Yep. It does go to overtime. And they're going to try to get the flag down. Neutralize it. Neutralize it. Neutralize it. Hold here, boy. Oh, they got him to break it. They, they did get him to breaking, so that will get him to, um... No, no! Yeah, because they'll, they'll go to last stand now. So the CSA should win this map now, yep. That's rough. Yeah, I feel like the Union played a lot better in the beginning, and then once that second point came along and it was on the other side of the map, everyone just spread out a lot too much. Yeah! There it is! Wow. CSA victory. Yeah, and I, really the decisive point came in the woods, and I didn't see that other charge on the other angle, but really that element that was attacking from that other side kind of opened it up. But uh, what did you, you think of the map overall? 
I think overall there was some fairly good movement from both sides. I think, especially when you're defending, when you're defending a point, you want to look for the advantageous places to defend and not just right next to the point. Like I say, I normally give, I normally try and like max myself at like a hundred, a hundred and fifty yards away, like as my radius around it of where I can kind of go where I'm still fairly close to it. Um, and when you're obviously it's a lot different to attacking because attacking you've got the pretty much the entire map to use to get around it and stuff. But defending, especially on that the third point, they should have tried to use the road and defend from the road and the forest instead of just just the forest because they let the CSA just get around them and obviously just envelop them from every angle. Yeah, I think you're right. Anyway, that's it for this first map. I'm going to go offline here for a second, and uh, we will catch you all on the second one.